My name's Izzy, and in today's video I wanted to talk about making bad art and why it's essential to your growth as an artist. I had huge ideas for this painting. I got a hit of inspiration and I sketched out the thumbnail exactly how I pictured it. I've been wanting to improve on my lighting and background and composition, so I pictured how I wanted the end result to look with all of these involved. However, it didn't turn out quite how I wanted it. Realistically, this was a huge step out of my comfort zone. I'm not very skilled with backgrounds or lighting, but I really wanted to recreate that image I had in my head. I didn't let my lack of skills and confidence put me off my goals. Even if the end result may turn out worse than I had in my head, I still push myself to practice these skills and learn along the way. The same way when we all started to draw for the first time, we didn't pick up a pencil and knew how to draw like Michelangelo. It took practice and experimentation to get to where we are now. All the first art we made was inevitably going to be bad. I struggled with how to even approach this painting. Did I do grayscale to colour, or did I use blending modes to achieve my desired look? I didn't let it stop me, and I pushed through with a method and just took it as a learning experience, even if I didn't like the end look. Even though I've been drawing for six years, I'm still creating art I'm unhappy with because I'm forcing myself out of my comfort zone to learn something new. If you never leave a comfort zone and are afraid of making bad art, you just won't improve. So yeah, I was unhappy with the end result of this. I felt like I could have done a much better job, but this is something I can work to improve on in my future artworks. I can identify specifically what I wasn't happy with, such as the lighting, and just focus to improve on this, which can be done by trying to implement lighting into all my future artworks to get plenty of practice. That's my take on creating bad art. Thank you for listening and enjoy the rest of the speed paint.